Hey guys, Ale Dog here to bring you a taste of a delicious game called Advanced Wars for the Game Boy Advance. I was motivated to do this when I saw a escape room player doing a video on the first level. This is one of my favorite game series of all time. I can't tell if it was the cartoonish glor glory of me slaughtering hundreds of people or this cleverly whorish cartoon character on my screen. So let's get going. Hmm. I think I think I'm okay. Hello, nice to meet you, Ale Dog. Can't blame you. I'm Ale Dog. Now that's a pretty whorish name now. I'm a co. Orange Star Army. What? Um, no, I'm too pro. Oh, I see how it is. This includes explanations of the game's rules too. If you really don't want to, I can teach you a way to pass through field training quickly. But do you want to know your work your way through the field training? No. Very well, let me explain a few things to you briefly. There are a few things different. There are uh, there are several different modes of, modes of gameplay. First mode multiplayer battles on one Game Boy Advance. T to play Advance Wars on multiple systems, link up with friends and try using Link Mode. There's training, blah blah blah. I'm gonna give you strategies. Fog of War. Yes, that's clear. Mm -hmm. I have to do this. I have to do field training. Yep. Wait, no, do I? Hold on, I'm very back. Sorry about that. We're back. I said I had to be clear on something quickly. I felt like I could just jump into the campaign, but apparently I need to do field training first. So here we go. We're in this large nation here, Orange Star. The country to the east of Blue Moon, also known for their creative names. The two countries have been better rivals for years. Border skirmishes have died down recently until that madman Olaf... Excuse me, I mean, uh, the Blue Moon Seal, Olaf, suddenly ordered an invasion of Orange Star. So the Al Alena Legion is now held by the Blue Moon forces. Canada Ale Dog, you've been given a mission, and you are to drive Olaf from Alaria and secure for Orange Star. I will be your support. Let's move out. You are a whore. Uh, Olaf has employed many troops here in the area. You yourself have two infantry units under your command. These orange units are yours. These blue moon units are the enemy. They belong to Blue Moon Army. Wow, I couldn't have figured that out by myself. Defeat the enemy forces to complete the mission successfully. Let's issue some orders. The curse is used to give commands. The plus or cross your choice control pad moves this cursor. First, let's command this infantry unit. We'd like to place the cursor of this infantry unit, please. I think I can handle that. Alright. The action is completed, but it's called selecting. You'll see this term often, and do your best to remember it. When you select a unit, the area around will become hi highlighted. This is the area represents the selected unit range of movement. First, let's approach the enemy with this unit. Try moving into this space. Move on the cursor here, and press the A button. After these moves, it will see a menu appear, so let's wait and then press the A button to confirm the command. The unit's color has changed, right? Yes, I can tell this. Thank you very much. Don't worry, they'll use it again next week. Oh, good, because I was getting kind of worried there. I'm afraid I'll never use it again. <sighs> Both units are moving, it's moving. Finish your turn. When you're finished using commands, press end, you must end your turn. Press A button and end your turn. I love your beard and your hat. Do, 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 do. How sad is that? I haven't played this game in like four, five years. So I still remember the music. How sad is that? Hmm, Orange Army units have moved to the Alena region. Ho ho ho! Ha! They won't last long. I am sad. That's evil cousin. Ha ha ha! My troops there will make sure it work at them. Bring it. Do, 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 do. Ho 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 ho! I see Olaf being like, seriously, sad as like evil cousin, and a really bad tactician, as I can see. Blah blah blah. Okay, you know what? I've, I'm I tire of you. No. Oh. Yeah, I know. Hey, you should attack that person. That'd be swell. Fire. Stop. Owned. You score damage on the enemy. Do you see the numbers on the units? This indicates that you need HP hit points. 
all units begin up 10 HP, but as they take damage in battle, their HP will decrease. When a unit reaches 0 HP, it vanishes in the screen, also known as dying. Thank you for the very PG description, Nell. Okay, you know what? They get it. Let's go finish this fight. School him. <laughs> this is how we do it. That's I cry, Santa. This is not giving me that pony. I mean, G.I. Joe. That's what I wanted. Didn't want no pony, but G.I. Joe. I were in the field, they wouldn't be suffering such humiliation. Ho, ho, ho. Curse or I'm sorry, I mean, I'll defeat it. I will. Okay. Take him out. No. This is how we do it. You defeated all enemy units. Your mission is a success. You have to get to work. Blah blah blah. What? Inconceivable! Ho ho ho! That land was mine! How did they lose so easily? Well, for stars you're an idiot, but let's keep going. Grr! Next time, victory will be mine! Ha ha ha! Congratulations, Nail Dog, you won. And we'll see the rank. Oh, A for Ale Dog. You won well. Power is based on how well you concentrated your attacks and overcame your enemies. Technique is based on how many of your own troops are lost. You'll earn a rank for each map you clear, so you can compare your scores to your friends. Good luck on your next campaign. Thank you, Nell. Um, question mark? Be right back. Um, we're back. This dumb thing might come up once in a while. I'm not sure why. I know, we'll, we'll figure it out. Defensive terrain cover. Yes. Uh-oh. Hmm, the enemy has deployed some mech. Mechanized infantry units. This could be trouble. Mech units have more firepower than your set infantry do. You won't be able to defeat a mech unit directly in combat, so you'll have to use the terrain to, your, to give you some more defensive cover. At least, I'll explain about the terrain features as we go. So, like this infantry unit, please. Thank you, now. Well, that's what we've learned so far. I'm an idiot, and I should leave Aldog alone. I agree. Let's go. Excellent. I agree. I am excellent. Oh my god, you are a whore. Basically, um, if you're in a forested area or um a wooded area, same thing, mountains, anything that give you cover cities and stuff, a new tax hold that's not in the situation you will not only lose less soldiers, but you will do more damage. So it's all good. Now I'll just sweep this. This guy's gonna get attacked next turn though, but acceptable loss. You know, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cut this video here for uploading time's sake, so this will be continued immediately, even though you may not see it until after next weekend, due to the fact we want our 100 videos spectacular to be spectacular and our 100 video. So if I don't see you to then, it's Ale Dog. See you later.